Hey what's up guys, this is Sky495 here, unboxing Inco's Astro E1 external battery. So this one was given to me as usual for my unbiased and thorough review. And I have received quite a few of Inker's external battery packs, so I have quite a bit of uh, experience with their technology. I have the PowerCore 10 4000, uh, 10,400, as well as the 10,000 that I recently just unboxed. So check out my channel to see that video. So this one here has a capacity of 5,120 milliamp hours, so it's more typical uh, the more typical size that you would usually carry around with this is it can usually power your smartphone uh, fully up to two times similar to the jackery bar here so let's just go ahead and take a look at the packaging it's a little bit different than what the power core lined up has so here we go it's just the contact information talking about the power iq technology and that's pretty much it. Alright, so it does say that you can tear off this part to get this um, external slipcover off, but I kind of like to keep the packaging as intact as possible so I can just slip this off actually. And then it's greeted with this nice cardboard box. And actually, if you were to tear it apart, you could see kind of their quick start guide built into the slipcover. <laughs> so, yep, and then here, let's just go ahead and continue on. So first thing you're greeted with is the battery. Ugh. Ooh my goodness. It is made out of their uber glossy material, which I really like to look at, but not so much to use it and get scratched up and stuff. I like to keep my things as new as possible and glossy finishes tend to not stay that way for long. But anyways, here's the four LED indicators to indicate how much charge there is. Inco branding here. You got the input which is micro USB and the IQ technology built into this USB output. Now where is the button? Here it is buttons here to see how much juice you have and it looks like it only has about 75 percent so I gotta charge this thing up to have a full charge and let's see what else is in this box okay have as usual anchor likes to give you all the necessary accessories with the product you're getting which is really nice of them and here is the micro USB charging cable as well as a nifty tiny little <laughs> mesh pouch with a drawstring which is really nice. I'm going to fit that in here. It's a nice fit. And then this is their feedback card. And here it's just their website. All right. Just for a quick size comparison, let's just go ahead and compare it to the Jackery Bar since it is comparable capacity. And the Anchor is definitely just slightly smaller in pretty much every dimension. So yeah, but what the Anchor lacks that the Jackery Bar does have is the a flashlight actually. Which, you know, it's just a little extra thing, but it would have been nice if Anchor had included this. I believe the previous iteration, this is the second generation E1, the previous iteration did have a bunch of other accessories, like, uh, I mean, extra features, like a flashlight and I believe a laser pointer, but that one had was only able to output at a maximum of 1 amp, but this one is able to have variable um, outputting uh, voltage, so this one is definitely a better buy. But that'll do it for this unboxing video. I'll have a review of this up shortly. Make sure to subscribe for my channel, YouTube channel, Skyforce95, for more product reviews and unboxings like this. Thanks for watching.